Good afternoon and welcome back to Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. My name is Justin Smith and today we're going to do a video on another brand new arrival here at the dealership. What we're looking at ladies and gentlemen is a 2012 GMC Savannah. Now this has the Explorer package on it and is what they call the XSE Limited. Now that is the top of the line package that Explorer offers and this is done in a graystone metallic with a silver bottom. So it's a two-tone paint scheme. And folks, this is an all-wheel drive conversion van. Very rare, very hard to come by. And this van only has 27,000 miles on it. So it's as good as new. Starting off here in the front, want to go over a few basic things. Uh, it does have the premium mesh grill along with the nice GMC logo right here. Explorer's exclusive license plate holder that acts as a step as well to make it easy to access your front windshield. Now moving around, again, this is a gray stone metallic with a silver bottom. Everything on this van is fully painted, mirrors, top, door handles, ground effects. Um, another signature Explorer feature is the vent here on the front fender. Now you're only going to find that in the XSE Limited package. Makes it, it really helps dress up the van. And of course, not to forget the uh, triple plated 20 inch premium chrome wheel and absolutely look gorgeous wrapped in Goodyear tires. Probably only 5,000 miles on these tires, so they're in great shape all the way around. Now moving down the side, you're gonna notice that we do have privacy glass along with the opera light. Now, this is something that Explorer does offer in their, in their package, and you do have the capability to turn this opera light on or off, so it's a really nice feature. And one thing I wanna talk about now is the condition. Um, again, for being a 2012 uh, and only having 27,000 miles, this van is as good as new. No door dings, paint is flawless all the way around. Truly a beautiful van. Okay, moving right along. Now we're uh, standing here in the back of this all-wheel drive Explorer conversion van. I want to go over some very important features, starting with the safety features that come with this van. Now this van does have a factory backup camera and that's uh, located right here in the rear brake light above the doors. So basically, how that works is anytime you put this van in reverse, your image, uh, you're going to get a visual of whatever's behind you, and that's going to show up real nice in your rear view mirror. Now, this van also does have the backup sensors as well. So not only are you going to get a visual from the, cam from the camera, you're also going to get an audible alert, and that comes from these backup sensors, and that's going to intensify um, the closer you, you might get to any object that might be behind you. So it's a really nice feature to have, and again, that's 100% factory. Um, this van does have a stability track and uh, traction control system. Now, the traction control works hand in hand with the all wheel drive. Now, if any of you guys have any questions on how the all wheel drive works on this particular van or any of the safety features, please give me a call and I'd be happy to go into that with better detail. Also, this van does have a factory tow package. It does have the tow haul button located directly right on the dash, and it is a class three receiver with all the wiring built in. Now, this van can safely tow up to 6,400 pounds, so it gives you a tremendous amount of capabilities uh, with this uh, Explore all-wheel drive conversion van. Okay, moving along to the back of this conversion van, I want to take this time just to go over the electronics and what comes with this van, uh, starting with the entertainment. Uh, this van is equipped with a 27-inch Vizio LED 240 hertz television. Now that's paired up with the Blu-ray player in the center console located between the front two seats. Now also in that center console, we do have a 110 input and also an HDMI input. So you can plug any gaming system or anything that virtually uses an HDMI and uh, reproduce that signal on the television. So it's a really neat feature. Also in the center console, we do have an iPod docking station. So um, depending on what model your iPhone is or what model your iPod is, you can stream that information directly to your TV and that's a really, really neat feature to have. Now when watching a, a video or a movie or whatever you're doing in the back of this van, you've got a couple different options for the audio. You can listen to it through the wireless headphones which are provided on this van or you can listen to it with the rear surround sound speakers which are throughout the whole back of the van. Now I'll take this time to talk about the privacy 
the storage, and probably the most important part of the conversion van, the seats that are in this thing. Starting with the privacy, as I mentioned earlier, we do have privacy glass around the whole vehicle, okay? Now on the inside, you do have privacy shades, which I have two of them up right now, on all the windows in the back of the van. So if you need that additional privacy or it's a really hot day, it's really nice to have those. Now, as far as the storage goes in this van, there's real nice storage bins located in the high top. They're all the way around the high top and they're on a real nice tinge door. They are lit storage and they do have a safety net, as you can see, to safely secure your items. Now, the seating in this van, um, I'm on the second row and I'm in these bucket chairs right here, which are two-tone leather. We do have the light gray leather with the dark gray inserts. Now these seats will fully recline, they will swivel, and they're also on a quick, uh, quick release pedestal. So you can easily remove one of these seats if needed uh, to, to put something big inside the van. They only weigh about 45 pounds, so it's not too hard to do that. Now as far as the rear sofa goes, the rear sofa is a three-piece power sofa. It does have a flip-down armrest in the middle, and that, the, the three-piece uh, flip-down sofa will lay fully flat and is the biggest sofa in the industry. So if you need to catch some rest or even spend the night in the back of this van, you can certainly do so. Um, and also one, one other thing that I want to key on and we'll show you later on this video is that this does have a rear sunroof, okay? There is a power sunroof located directly above the rear sofa and it does have a nice sunshade as well and is a fully functional sunroof which you can vent and fully retract all the way back Okay, moving along to the driver's uh, seat here in this 2012 all-wheel drive Explorer. I want to go over all the features that come with this van, starting with the power equipment. Now, obviously, this van, as you would expect, has power windows on both sides, power mirrors on both sides, which are breakaway and a heated mirror. Uh, it does have a keyless entry. It does have two key fobs included. And on the key fob, you also do have a factory remote start, so that's a really nice feature to have in the winter time. Now moving over to the dashboard, we have a fully leather wrapped wheel with steering controls on both sides, left and right. Now the ones on the left are, gonna, are for your cruise control function, and the ones on the right are going to uh, operate your navigation radio. station or radio. Uh, Moving along to the dash, you, we do have the real nice Denali wood trim in here. Um, and uh, I want to talk about some of the buttons and the charging ports that we have on the dash. Now we do have three ports for charging up here, two of them are DC, one is a USB. And then we also have some buttons here located right below the radio. And then above those buttons you're also going to notice uh, is where the, the radio is and that is a factory navigation system. Um, it does have an AM FM tuner in it, a CD uh, slot, and also a 3.5 millimeter jack so you can plug an audio source in there and listen to your music. Okay, now the seats in the front of this van, uh, exact same seats as, as in the back of the van. You have the real nice two-tone two leather. They are light gray with the dark gray inserts. Now these are on an eight-way power pedestal and they do have a power recline as well. And probably the two po or most important features of, of the front two seats are the, uh, the heat and the power lumbar. And those are located on the armrest right here. Again, my name is Justin Smith and I want to thank you for joining us today here at Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. And I hope you liked the video that Brian and I did today on this new arrival here at the dealership, this 2012 all-wheel drive Explorer conversion van. Now if you have any particular questions pertaining to this van that we did a video on, or any of the vans on our website, or even something that you're maybe possibly looking for that we don't have, please don't hesitate to give me a call. I'm always around and willing to uh, give you my time to help you out the best I can. Now, for those of you that are specifically looking for a conversion van or just like the videos that we do here at the dealership, I kindly ask you that you subscribe to our YouTube channel and even like our Facebook uh, page. That's gonna ensure you, you won't miss out on the new, the latest and greatest arrival here at Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. Thanks again.